Facing Suffering, Embracing Reality Today we embark on a journey to understand the intricate connection between suffering and the human tendency to escape from it. As the mind encounters sorrow, it often resorts to various means of distraction and comfort-seeking. But is there an alternative path? When physical suffering arises, we seek medical help to find a cure. However, when it comes to psychological suffering caused by loneliness, failure, or lack of love, we turn to psychological palliatives. But what if, instead of escaping, we face these realities head-on? Many books and teachings talk about the possibility of ending sorrow. They offer ideas and concepts, but have we truly ended suffering? Are we still using these concepts as a way to escape the actuality of sorrow? Let's ponder this together. Can we refrain from running away this time from seeking comfort and soothing words? Can we confront our suffering directly without any escape or rationalization? Attachment is another facet of our consciousness that binds us. We attach ourselves to people, ideas, and beliefs, often without fully comprehending the consequences. Jealousy, anxiety, fear, and loneliness are some of the outcomes of attachment. For those who believe in a higher power, we often become attached to the idea of God, using it to escape our worldly miseries. But does that God truly provide answers to our struggles? As we delve deeper, we realize that the observer is not separate from the observed. The one experiencing suffering is the same as the one witnessing it. There is no division between the two. So, if the observer is suffering, is there a way to bring clarity to this connection? Can we invest all our energy into understanding suffering rather than seeking comfort? Just like focusing light on an object reveals its true nature, bringing our full energy to suffering allows us to see it clearly. In this clarity, a profound transformation occurs. When we merge with suffering, realizing we are sorrow itself, an extraordinary shift happens. The energy once dissipated in escape now becomes an intense focus that illuminates the reality of suffering. And in this profound attention, a mind free from sorrow emerges. We understand that escaping suffering was a waste of our energy. Embracing reality allows us to be fully present and liberated. As we conclude this journey, let us remember to face suffering, embrace reality, and dissolve the boundaries between the observer and the observed. May we find the courage to let go of escape and embrace life's challenges with unwavering clarity and wisdom. Thank you for watching this enlightening video. If you found it valuable, be sure to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more thought-provoking content. Remember, true liberation lies in facing suffering and embracing reality. Until next time, stay mindful and be free from sorrow.